Hey guys, this is um, Catch the Derp, bringing you a really good game actually, The Wolf Among Us. <sighs> Need some refreshments before I start, but um, I'd like to say, first of all, I kind of fucked up, got a big time. Um, the first chapter recorded off of my webcam microphone, and I sound like I'm trapped inside of a box the whole time. They do not like the way it sounds. So, it's the first episode. So we did the trip trap and all this stuff, and we finished. Now, um, it was show I did last, last time. Wow, where's my English? I'll show what I did last time. I'm not going to redo chapter 1 because it's just not going to be a genuine. And... Eh... We'll see. I understand people will be upset over that. And... I wish I did, that didn't happen. And I would upload the first one, but you do not want to hear what it sounds like. The, like the webcam microphone is a complete crap bag of donkeys. It's not the greatest. Anyways, we'll work with it. There's plenty more chapters to go through, and... Mr. Toad? Yeah. Do something, Bigby, before he completely tears up the place! Whoa, 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 hey, hey! You've got something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid c- You're not as bad Ouch. as everyone says you are. Please, Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. Look, whatever it is, it's between you and Beast. I'm staying out of it. It's not what you might be thinking. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Nope. Haven't seen her. Come with me. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow! You asked me a question. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. No, I'm D. He's dumb. But he said if word of this ever got back to me, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill me. I'm looking for the woodsman. Well, he's not here. Holly, you're out of paper towels and uh, they're gonna string me up, baby. That it looks fucking bad. It looks really bad, but I didn't do it. All right, I got a hundred bucks for the first bloke that can tell me something about a girl name. Fuck, man! This fucking laptop. Come sniffing around this place. The rich fucks in the world just need a shakedown. Ain't that right, big baby? Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much. Hey, there we go. So that was a basic summary of what happened last time. Luckily, it was the first chapter only. If I did, like, the first two or three chapters, then I'd be like, fuck. So. Oh, well. Oh, yeah, the reaction. this more difficult than it has to be. Who the hell are you? If you just cooperate and answer the questions, you can go home. Maybe get some sleep. The fuck sleep? How are you feeling? Tacos. I know it's been a long night for you. You look like you could use some rest. Ah, <sighs> hunky-dory. I'm hunky-dory. Thanks for asking. There's no need to get aggressive. I'm trying to help you. Look. I know what you must be going through. Really, I do. But I could use your cooperation. 
You know, I hate to say it, but I don't think you do. Of course. You're... you're right. I can't imagine what you're going through right now. Oh, goody, they're watching me. God, look at that TV. Good old days of RCA. What is it with you cops? Always trying to empathize with people. I know this must be hard for you. Do you? Do you fucking know? Have you had a friend killed and their head left at your fucking doorstep? No. Didn't think so. Your nose is bleeding. How do you know before it started bleeding? <gasps> you missed the spot. Yeah, missed the spot. Yeah, you, uh, you just smeared it across your face. You got a tissue or something? Detective Brannigan? I'm Detective Brannigan. What? Uh, yeah, I know. Oh I my just god. Said that. Is there something? Dead. We have to go now. Uh, what are you doing here? You should be thanking me. <laughs> it's just a memory wipe spell. Very expensive, but it works. The whole station will forget the last 24 hours and everything they saw at the woodlands. Oh, wow. Well, hurry up. <laughs> just take a smoke, like, yeah. Make sure. You take that photo. Oh. So why does he keep staring at that for the whole episode, I swear? And then he's gonna go with that. Oh wait, she's dead too. Um let's say with that one chick that we saw at the beginning. The girl with the woodsman at first. I was like, oh yeah, she's the first one to die. We are in love interest now. Okay, awkward car ride, check. <clears throat> Random. Uh, I'll say thanks for the ride. Thanks for the lift. Certainly. Certainly. We, um, we found Tweedledee chained up to a post. It was your doing, correct? Maybe. Yeah. I don't know why you detained him. D was at the trip trap when Snow was left at the woodlands, so he couldn't possibly be involved in this mayhem. Bluebeard's currently interrogating him. He has a brother. And he hasn't said anything useful. And a big B, we have to tread carefully here. He's working for somebody. Whoever it is wants him snooping around every crime scene I've looked at. That doesn't necessarily mean they're involved in the murders. Oh, I should have said the one about the brother. Oh, no. Hey, King Street. I know King Street. Will he be something? I know what you're thinking, Bigby. It's been one full night and a slice of morning, and I already miss her too. I don't know why he's so nice all of a sudden. You know, I never get more homesick. Dies now. For it to be snow, I've never been good with these sorts of things. I just can't believe uh, this is really. I'll be as nice as I can. Yeah. It's hard. Our stories used to be so simple. We had a beginning, a middle, and an end. Just my cook. But ever since we moved to this awful city, everything's gotten so confused. Did she um, give any indication to what she was thinking? When you saw her last, I mean. 
I don't know why, but I'd like to know that she was... Be careful. I guess fine, I suppose. She just told me to be careful. She was always fond of you. I don't know what she else said to last. say, Bigby. We have to have to put an end to this. It's been two murders in as many days. If we don't unearth our culprit, and soon there will likely be another on our doorstep tonight. I'll get it done. Please, Bigby, for Miss White. I got it. Ooh, that's gonna cost you a couple dollars. Damn, I wish I was that strong. Holy, this is a long That's intro, not though. a very good answer, is it? Come on. Just tell me what I Wait, want. I think this is the intro. It will make things a lot less painful for you, in theory. Oh, were you planning on using that? I just thought you really liked rubbing your little sword. <laughs> what the hell do you think you're doing? Hello, Ichabod. Sheriff. <laughs> Ichabod. Bluebeard. I was just chatting with our new friend. You were supposed to wait for us to get back. I told you, if you want to be involved, you will do things my way. No violence! Whatever you say, Ichabod. Hello, Big B. <laughs> I want answers, D. Oh, goody. I thought you wanted questions, and I was having so much trouble thinking of any good ones. Though I'd settled on... How's your head? You see what I've been dealing with? What are you going to do about this, Bigby? <laughs> it's been, been better, but we're not here to talk about me. Snow White is dead. Look, I didn't kill anyone. And I'm supposed to just believe you. You were with me when it happened, dummy. I still have questions for you, D. <sighs> Sounds like a personal problem. This is ridiculous. Let him work. He's got more experience with these kinds of things. You know I saw you at Faith's apartment. What were you doing there? The girl's got air conditioning. You can't imagine what it's like living in a little shithole with no air. I'm not fucking around here, D. All right, D. Let's get to know each other. Mm. Are you done yet? Don't make me look at that. Just put that away. Please. This is why we're here. Someone killed this woman, and we need to know who. I get it, I do. But I can't tell you what I don't know. Just tell me what you were doing at Faith's apartment. Look, Bigby, we're not on opposite sides here. My brother and I are trying to get to the bottom of things. Same as you. I got D talking. Yeah, I'm just gonna try to Your persuade. Oh. Where was he last night? I can't say. He could have been anywhere. Take your best guess. He didn't do it, if that's what you're thinking. Then where is he? No, I'm not sending you after my brother. Look, I answered your question. Can I get my stuff back now? Here's what did nice. you find on it? Oh, uh, nothing of consequence, really. Mm hmm. Give him... I should be leading the interrogation. We can't have that. Give him a smoke. Looks like... I'm saving that. <laughs> eh, we'll offer it here. Yeah, all right. <laughs> yeah, all right. Want to see a trick? Shit in the beer bottle. Find out what happened to those girls, to Snow White, 